And rising temperatures after this wet winter have crews gearing up for what could be another busy upcoming fire season. They're clearing miles and miles of fire roads so when they get that call for service, they'll have clear access. They've left about 120 miles of road system that have trees down, landslides, root wad blocking our access. Heavy equipment has moved in at Big Basin Redwood State Park, removing what came down this winter. Large obstacles on the path must be removed now before emergency crews are summoned to a call. Wildland fire season is just around the corner and that's why they have to open up these access roads. They're trying to get their road system back in so that when fire season hits later this year, we're able to get out there and concentrate on putting fires out and not opening roads. Big Base and Redwood State Park in the Santa Cruz Mountains had a number of popular hiking trails cut off by trees and mudslides. Soon they'll be focusing their efforts on clearing Aptos Creek Fire Road. Access for uh, emergency equipment is, is very limited. Uh, so the, the extreme backcountry of Nicene Marks is, is currently closed. Uh, next week we will have heavy equipment uh, operating and we're going to have a hard closure of the, the roads in there. The need to clear these fire roads is now. Emergency crews are already receiving calls into these remote areas. A week and a half ago, there was a rescue that took almost all day because the crews had to walk all the medics in and then basically carry everybody out. Normally, it takes a couple of weeks to clear the debris. After these recent storms, it'll take at least a month. The biggest thing we need is access to the areas where we have fires. And the fire road clearance work is also a good training exercise in a non-emergency situation right now. So when the real thing hits, they will be prepared. Erin? Sounds good. All right. Thank you, Phil. Wildfire season could begin as early as the end of this month.